First open Visual Studio and click on create a new project. Then select empty project click next and name your project. Remember the location of project folder. Open Solution Explorer by clicking Ctrl Alt F and then go to Properties then Package Manager. Search for Raylib and install it. Now make a new folder on desktop, where we are going to download in GUI temporarily. Now we are going to clone in GUI and RL. ING UI repository. Link is in the description. Now follow each and every steps carefully. On left side, we have the project folder created by Visual Studios, and on right side we have out folder where we clone the repository. Create a folder, dependencies, then an include folder inside it. Here we put all header files. From INGU, I folder copy all header files to include folder. Similarly copy header file from our Allen GUI to include folder. Also copy the extras folder. Now copy the C++ files from ingui and RL ingui folder as shown, but this time into root directory of project. Now the project directory should look like this. Visual Studio has no idea that we make a new folder and put the header files in it, so we must include them all in our project by right click and include in project, and then specify the path of our include directory in additional includes.
Now we make a normal Raylib program to see if it runs without error. In order to use imbui in Raylib, import imbui, our al imbui. Then specify our al imbui setup method before while loop. Inside draw method use our al imbui begin and end method and finally our al imbui shutdown outside while loop. Here I create a imbui window with a text. Here is another example. If you found this video helpful, please consider liking and subscribing. Your support means a lot and helps us create more content like this. Thank you for watching.